Hey Internet, welcome back to another episode of Road to 120 Slayer. So today we are slaying gargoyles. Pretty basic slayer monster, nothing too interesting. Okay, so, real life, New Zealand is in a lockdown again. In game, so also no progress on the job front. So in game, we are 4.3 mil from 119, slowly getting there. Yesterday we were 4.6, so making slow progress. No sphere of annihilation yet. Just farming materials for herb lore. You know the same aim thing. It's pretty much what I do on the daily now. And yep, still 100k, but this is level 4. Okay, so we won't be leveling up invention right now. Okay. Let's go in there and slay some gargoyles. They drop a lot of gems, that's why I bought the gem bag, or the artificer's measure. They don't really hit hard, which is fine. So for gargoyles you do need a rock hammer, which is in my Slayer tool belt. So why aren't I slaying them in Kurdal's dungeon? That's a good question. I can. But I just don't want to. It's the same, you know, like, yeah, you get that little bit of bonus, and yes, technically, it's more efficient to go there, but I have to walk through Hellhounds, which bite my armor, which kind of, like, decreases my charge a little bit, so I kind of just went here. Speaking of charge, I should probably check how much charge I've got left. Uh, okay. 30... 384k. That's dropped from 500k charge. Alright. Yeah, I definitely need to... do some divination to restore it. So I guess that's what I'll be doing after this task. Alright. These things don't drop anything special, so... There's not much to say. They die fairly quickly. They're weak to magic, but you can just use anything, really. They drop a lot of salvage, so I guess that's good if you just want to disassemble them for invention or just sell them on Grand Exchange. So salvage can be disassembled for components and stuff. That's their only purpose. You can high-alk them, I guess, but yeah. They serve no purpose but for invention. Right. Would it be more efficient to kill them with magic? Probably. Considering that magic's been buffed a little bit. Apologies. Um, someone walked in the room. Okay, right, yeah, so magic's been, so the tier 
the surges have been leveled up to level 99 magic. They used to be tier 92, now they're tier 99, so yes, using magic is the most efficient way to slay them. But these guys die in like three slashes anyways, three to four slashes, so doesn't really matter. They got low defense, yeah, low attack. They're like a low to medium level monster, so it's not that bad. And why am I slaying them? I had no choice, I couldn't skip them. I've been skipping all the bad tasks lately, I ran out of um, Slayer points. It is what it is. That's okay. Right. What else can I say? I wish they were aggro though. I guess that they're okay, they're not aggro, so I can have time to disassemble. But aggro, I can group them all up and just attack them. I, I think they are aggro, but they're not like permanently aggro. Like after 20 minutes they just start becoming aggro. Alright. They dropped a spirit ruby. If it, there was 120 summoning, I would probably use that. But since summoning is only up to 99, there's not much point. I guess I'll bank it and save it until they release. 90, uh, 120 summoning. But yeah, they may or may not do that. I think it would make sense for them to do that, to be honest. Just like to summon more creatures. And also, there's some older um, pits that you can't understand that, you know, like. So, if you get a pit in RuneScape, like, you need a certain summoning level in order to talk to it. I don't know, that might be some thing that like some players are into talking to their pets and stuff. I'm not really about that. I sort of just got 99 summoning and just stopped because there's no more benefits to go higher than that. And the reason why it's a hundred is just because I trained it a little bit, just because it was really close to one hundred. But yeah, no other reason to be honest. Right. Uh, what else can I say? Poor drops. XP is bad. It's a low-level Slayer monster. You heard it all before. Right. I think we've reached 10 minutes, I hope. Uh, where can you buy a rock hammer from the Slayer Master? And I will show you what that looks like now. So... A rock hammer looks like this thing. Okay. As you can see, you can right click and smash. So, if you don't have the instant slayer kill um, ability that uses the item for you, you have to manually smash them once you get them down to 0 HP.
All right. I think that's all, to be honest. Thanks for watching. Hope you had a great day. Be sure to like, subscribe, share with your friends, ring the bell, turn on all notifications. Leave a comment on what you're doing in RuneScape and what your journey is. Until next time, see ya!